so, so good against these characters that love to interact because he's like, all right, your your thing is my, your combo is my combo now. All right. Same thing with Wolf. So I'm really, uh, really curious to see how K9 is going to space Luigi out and, you know, utilize his dash back F smash that he's really known for and how Elegant's going to be trying to hold in and use his plunger to, you know, hit K9. Here we go, using the up tilt to kind of throw him out and you now baits out the air dodge. Gets the plunger, tries to go for the dare, but doesn't find it and just gets sent flying off of the up B. Yeah, that's going to be super, super hard for the spaces, especially in this type of matchup, just because Elegant, no stranger to, you know, edgeguarding spaces. He is a spacey main in melee, after all. I mean, to be fair, like, there's not that many characters you can actually legitimately main in melee. I mean, you can play Luigi. You can play Luigi. <laughs> you can play Luigi. A fantastic dash attack just to catch Elegant's landing. Oh, there's this oh, oh, there's wolf flash, but yeah. you know, that's a fantastic just like, oh yeah, you're you're doing that? Alright, I don't care, I take 18% damage. I'll just at least close out the stock. He has right. consistent ways of closing out socks now against uh, this character that, you know, always gives him more chances because of interaction. There we go, there's the re -grab. No, obstacle no. for the dash attack. Oh, just really tries to go super hard in there. Oh, but there, you're talking about super hard, and yet again, that down B was one of those options. And K9 just kind of hopping around Luigi, just hoping that he throws out an option and lands with a fair or an air. And wow, just K9 so, so smart, just backing off and throwing a few lasers before going in again. It's going to be really, really hard for Elegant to kind of just get back. Scouting out that dash back forward smash with the dash attack himself. And here we go, looking for the bear, not going to find it, and so he gets parried. Oh, oh but there's an air. Unfortunately, yeah. does not tech that uh, that drop zone there. Yeah. I think drop zones are cool. It's kind of like the, uh, please get hit by this type of thing. I don't want to play this game anymore. That right. That's like that type of move. Just, please, I don't want to do it. It's Hail Mary. Oh, but fantastic up smash coming out. Everybody freaking out yeah. about this game. Yet again, here we go. Gets the re-grab of the up smash. And just off to Cyclone to say, all right, nope. You can't, you can't complete your combo off of me right now. And K9 just trying to keep Elegant above him, because if he's above him, then he can't get grabbed. This is looking super, super tense right now, just because K9 is very playing around Luigi's uh, Luigi's effective zone and just dodging in, weaving back and forth, back and forth. And Elegant just so hard, like, doing his best to trying to get in there, utilizing his plungers and stuff. All right. Here we go. There's a fair to just get him off stage. And trying to go for the grab, trying to end it all with the, the Cyclone. Yeah, but he eats a back air for his troubles. K9 just missing his own back air. Oh, getting in. Both players trying to go for their grabs, you know. But there's a dash attack. Manages to avoid the last hit, but gets spared. Gets oh, that's tech. crazy. That's crazy, dude. What? I mean, K9 did everything right, but he went for that side B, and you know what? There was enough end lag where Elegant could punish it. Yeah, exactly. The you know the optimal thing, as everybody would like to say, right down in the YouTube comments, is hey, why don't why don't you uh, air dodge and stuff like that? When you're in that type of situation, you need to get back as fast as possible to center stage. Yeah, yeah to center stage is like Wolf Flash looks pretty fast. All these options look really really fast. But again, Luigi and Elegant was, were plus on frames because he's the one that initially hit that first interaction. Right. But getting back into this. Kananas Bruce versus Elegant playing the, uh, I believe this is the uh, uh, Smash 64 Pokemon Stadium song. Here we go. Elegant just throwing out all these aerials, hoping that K9 jumps into them, but not going to fall for it. He again catches the double jump and manages the air dodge to ledge. Oh, just shield checks him. Kananas Bruce. Letting go of shield a little bit too much, maybe wanting to try to jump out of it to see if uh, he was trying to go for jab, jab, grab. Right. I mean, it's one of those things where, like, you see, uh, you know, your opponent, like, jabbing your shield, and you're, you're worried for Elegant just because, like, oh, he might grab me, so if I don't do something, then I'm going to get grabbed and I'm going to die for it. 
but wow, it looks really, really hard for Elegant to get off the stage or get off the ledge right now, just because of all these um, all these forward tilts getting back over there. But Fantastic just runs up jab, jab, uh, forward smash. I'm surprised he didn't up B there, because I'm pretty sure up B would have killed. But I guess he wasn't confident that it would have connected in time. Yeah, either that or like he's like, oh, I don't want it to sail. I'm, I might zero to death him next stock or something like that. But wow, just goes all the way down there to say no, no possible chance for you to, you know, live. I want the satisfaction of sending you off to the blast zone. All right. Wow, I mean, K9 what? was already dead, but like Elegant just wanted to make sure. Yeah, exactly. But getting a uh, small punish for the for his own grab of 25%, and after getting 34% extra credit, Elegant now in disadvantage. Here we go, gets the down tilt. Not going to fall for the down B. And yet again, he's just back off stage. And I feel like this game has just been Elegant being in the corner for about like half the game and then the other half is them just getting an explosive combo to even things up. Yeah, exactly. And I really like how K9 utilized his side B or no his up B rather than a side B just because Elgin was super aware that he liked using the side B. And now getting back into this after that clean stock from Elgin. Could we see another one? Oh, oh. gets the air dodge, but you know I wasn't expecting it, so it doesn't go for the re-grab. Yeah, exactly. He wasn't really expecting that, and I don't think he has a double jump. That's why he air dodged. Yep, he doesn't. Just barely gets clipped with those two nares, and now it's basically back to about even. Oh, oh just there we go. instantly, hey, you touched my shield? Nah, bro. Big nah. Yeah. You cannot be anywhere near Luigi when he touches shield, because he can just up be right out of it, and even if it shield, like, even if you shield it or you spot, like you would have to spot dodge immediately in order to avoid getting up beat. Yeah, exactly. And a lot of these other characters that do a um, that do a soft hit nair on shield and stuff like that, they don't have enough time to uh, hit the ground actually, and then they get hit uh, like by that up beat. Right. But playing against the sortie, it's probably going to be more in Lucina's favor, in my opinion. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then Lucina can also go out deeper and yeah. go for an edge guard a little bit harder. Exactly. She could counter the misfire. She could do all this stuff. But again, sorties, in my opinion, really like to come down with a lot of aerials because, you know, they, they're just like, oh, yeah, you can't punish me at, uh, a lot of the time. I have, you know, the sword and stuff like that. Whereas for Luigi, he's one of those characters that could actually punish those unsafe aerials or those safe aerials, quote, unquote, from the sorties right. because of his downbeat. Fantastic. Just basically zero death the first 30 seconds of the match. Probably like 20-ish. Yeah, it was 30, but like, yet again, it's one of those things where like, their damage outputs are like super strong. And then again, going for the up B, I mean, that's 30% right there. Oh, oh wow, he doesn't have a double jump. Yeah, that's a fantastic zero to death from NVR Elegant from the Inland Empire. Right. <laughs> you know, I don't want to say it's completely out of K9's favor, because like, if you can get this edge guard, then like, he's golden and all he needs is like two more. Yeah, but, exactly. Just you know what? Elegant's not going to give him that. Yeah, Elgin yeah. knows his character. He knows its limits. He knows what he can do. And Elgin is just going to like make sure everything he can do is like, oh no. Yeah, he he, he didn't have a double jump, and he kind of saw like, oh yeah, I'm gonna get edge guard by like a down B because most of the uh, mid level players from like Lucina to Krom and stuff like that, they instantly like to throw out a a hitbox to kind of like, oh hey yeah, he's gonna fall into this right, but. Oh, I'll get no super, super good on yeah. just conserving his resources. And yet again, that was K9's chance to, you know, even up the stocks right there. Wow, just goes for these down Bs, knowing that K9 really needs to make something happen. So he's going to be taking all these unnecessary risks and not really, uh, and not really respect Luigi's down B. But fantastic forward smash coming out from K9 Bruce to even up the stocks. Right, and you know what, K9. He was down, but he is certainly not out at this point. I can definitely see him bringing it back. You know, all these up airs throwing Luigi into a display. But oh, that could have been so much damage. Well, that technically could have been it because he would have been in an edge guard situation. Right. And while just, I think Elegant's just playing with his food kind of at the moment. Nah. Uh, oh, wow, good. just runs up and does it. But you know what? Good DI, and it's on the ground. And again, Elegant. Just, dude, he's just. He's just using down. He's just. He's basically a fox player in melee. No, dude. He he plays. 
Falco in melee. He's used to that. He's just used to just pressing down B, running up, pressing down B. He's wave shining him. Oh my god.